the rising number of deaths in the country and the national capital remains a cause for concern. We've brought you reports of how the crematoriums and burial grounds are overburdened. But how are the people who actually work there coping with this? There are young men, including some as young as 19, working at crematoriums. NHTV's Meher Pandey went to Ghazipur Crematorium in Delhi and spoke to the workers there. A 19-year-old crematorium worker is building his seventh pyre of the day at Ghazipur Crematorium in West Delhi. He works in the dedicated COVID section of the crematorium without any PPE. The flames are too hot and too close to wear a plastic suit. He didn't want us to reveal his name because of the social stigma attached to this work, which is usually performed by people of the scheduled castes. Far from home in Ayodhya, UP, he works more than 12 hours a day and sleeps on the premises. He has left the cremation ground only twice in the last two months as he needs to be available almost 24 hours a day as the COVID-19 death toll in Delhi reaches record highs. Bodies also arrive here from the neighbouring UP. He says he can't think too deeply about these deaths. मैं अपने आप को दी हमारा सादा भोजन है करते हैं और थोड़ा वर्कआउट तरीके से पूछ रहे हैं नहीं मानसिक ज्यादा हम दिमाग पे जोर नहीं लेते हैं ठीक है जी जो काम हमें करना है वो हम आराम से करते हैं द प्रीस्ट हियर रामकरण मिश्रा टोल्ड अस दैट द वर्कर्स डिड नॉट हैव द टाइम टू गेट वैक्सीनेटेड टीका नहीं लगा वैक्सीन को ये यहां पे कोई उपलब्ध नहीं कि कराया वैक्सीन तो यहां अभी हम लोगों को किसी को टीका नहीं लगा अगर यहाँ पे अगर आगे स्वयं यहाँ पे अगर क्योंकि यहाँ बहुत डेड बॉडी आती है बहुत समस्या हम लोगों के पास टाइम नहीं है सरकार को तो पता है सारी बात कहाँ वैक्सीन पहुँचानी कहाँ नहीं पहुँचानी है बाकी अब क्या बताएं सरकार को वर्कर्स हियर आर पेड बिटवीन टेन टू फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड रुपीज अ मंथ एंड नॉन फेल्ट कम्फर्टेबल शेयरिंग द लास्ट टाइम दे वेड दे फील दे आर परफॉर्मिंग देर रिलीजियस ड्यूटी We have seen body after body arrive here at the Ghazipur crematorium. The workers here work almost 24 hours a day and then they lay their beds right here in the open air and get 2-3 hours of sleep a night. They are overworked, underpaid, unvaccinated and uninsured. And it's time the government showed some support. With Pooja Arya, Meher Pandey for NDTV.